For the 17th ranked Washington Huskies, it's all about playing fast this year. In the end zone, touchdown, touchdown, back to back big plays. Oh, look at that. Sankey's got a run on the Callier to the corner. Sankey's got a touchdown. Today, in their new and improved Husky Stadium, the Dogs seek their first 3 0 start since 2001. It's Washington hosting Idaho State right now on Pac-12 Networks. Idaho State from the FCS and the Big Sky Conference. Here's a kick taken at the 20 by Smith. Turns and veers to the 30-yard line, wrapped up and knocked down. Keep an eye on number 25, Bishop Sankey, the junior from Spokane. Here's the fake give to Sankey, rolling out and throwing here to the near side is to Austin Safarian Jenkins, number 88. Big part is getting him involved early. Four receivers wide right. Price pump fakes, then fires a pass right side. This is Sankey, who caught a touchdown pass a week ago. And there's a penalty flag down on the field. Of course, at Eastern Washington. And a native of Colton, Washington, near Pullman. Here is Sankey breaking across the 40 to the 50. And he is into Idaho State Bengal territory, run out of bounds near the 42-yard line. And Sankey now has, with that run, exceeded 2,000 yards in this game. Mickens drops back into the backfield, takes the handoff, scoots left side off tackle, and dragged down just across the 35-yard line. And a ball recovered by Idaho State. Bengals have the football in their own territory. Four wides here on third and ten for Idaho State. Early movement across the line. Fumble on the field. Ball loose near the 26-yard line. And Washington has it. And they put it on the deck twice last week. It was a quick pass. This is Smith. Avoids a tackle. Breaks a tackle. Motors through two defenders right down the center of the hash marks inside the five-yard line. And Smith has got great chemistry with Keith Price. It's pretty evident. Oh, you talk to NFL scouts around the league, and they love Smith. His toughness, they remind him of Anquan Bolden. Now they're trying to finish. The Huskies are down near the goal line, and they get into the end zone. And it is Bishop Sankey. Touchdown, Washington. Style punter, he will roll out. And you see it end over end, squipping down there to the 30. Takes a wicked hop back there to the 20. It is grabbed by John Ross, the outstanding freshman. They hem him in, force him to the middle of the field, still on his feet. And a great tackle, ball coughed up, picked up by Washington, and they are dragged down inside the 15 yard line. Well, that's moments. Let's see how our kids react to this backed up inside our own 15. Diamond formation to the right of Price. Hands near side to Sankey. Breaks 20, 25, and spilled out of bounds at the 30-yard line. Bishop Sankey is already having a big afternoon running. Three penalties all season long right now. You, you can't hurt yourself in those situations. Second and 20. Delay handoff. Sankey left side to the 30. To the 35. Run out of bounds at the 40-yard line. Talking to Eric Kisov, the offensive coordinator yesterday, Yogi, he said, Sankey's a guy just reads his block. He does not have the blinding speed, but man, he can play hits five different holes. They went 75 yards with the opening possession of the third quarter in Chicago. Rolling right, Price behind the line of scrimmage, throwing complete over to Cason Williams to the end line, jukes the defender, and he's steered down just inside the 30 yard line. Well, we talk about playing regulars by this time last year. They're healthier this year. They open up a little space left side. Bouncing it outside is that man. And across the 15-yard line is Jesse Callier. Price in the gun. Fakes the handoff. Throwing far side. Cason Williams just ran over the cornerback and then is forced out of bounds. Cason Williams, strong on strong. He is 6-2. It's splendid. I think you look at him, and he is able to dominate the game in a lot of areas. Slipping a tackle, bouncing 10, moving horizontally. Now the vertical blast into the end zone. Touchdown, Washington. Jesse Callier. Callier, the junior from Downey. The redshirt junior who's had multiple knee surgeries and finally healthy and back on the field. There's a 
pass to Austin Safarian Jenkins. He's literally dragging two defenders down near the first down. And the Washington sideline response, they love that extra effort that may have gotten them a first down. A really good way they look with their formations. Nine play drive for the Huskies. Price sets his back foot, throws complete over the middle. It's Austin Safarian Jenkins. Shot down near the goal line. They'll put it at about the one yard line. Well, that's where you put it to the big fella. Right on his numbers. We'll, we'll see if they go left side behind Austin Safarian Jenkins. Here's the handoff and a great job up front by the Bengals. Into the end zone. Touchdown Washington. And it's Keith Price with a fake handoff and Price sneaking into the end zone. The stadium and it's not easy and I think that's been a great welcoming addition to this staff. Van Winkle will rip one. Cameron Gupton will take it. Oh! Hit hard just across the 10 yard line and the cap popped off. And Gupton, we're happy to report, gets immediately to his feet and sprints over to the sideline. Trailing 21 0. And Arias back to throw. Hard rush coming on his left side. Pass incomplete and a big hit. Applied Washington to receive this one. Rugby style end over end that dies at the 50. Ross will take it at the shoestrings. Jukes a man, goes straight ahead and gets across the 40 yard line of the Bengals. Baby, he was lavishing praise on Cooter. Here's Price, angles, great catch. Cason Williams, full extension, makes the grab at the 22 yard line. Oh, he's got it's absolutely beautiful. Huskies go to work. Cal, your left side behind a big block 20. Turns it in 15, spins just shy of the 10 yard line. That time the offensive line fired off with great efficiency for Walker. The Huskies. Taking the handoff, Price rolls, pass complete, touchdown. Washington, his second touchdown reception of the year. Joshua Perkins, the sophomore from Cerritos, California, got an 18 yarder in week one against Boise State. He's a good looking tight end. We put off the capital needs and on my mind right now, we're building a baseball stadium, which is going on. But we're going to talk about a basketball operations center. Thank you so much. All right, thanks for having me. Kevin? Joe, thank you. Great job. I hear you, Doug. They're going to count on him to be the leader in that back end going up against Pac-12 teams. Price back to throw, sets his feet, has a man open. Mickens comes back to it, turns, swivels, knocked down at the five-yard line. Shade on Mickens, the burner. 30 on the play. Price goes to work. Fakes the handoff to Cooper, flips over the middle, touchdown Washington, just like that. Austin Safarian Jenkins makes the grab. Safarian Jenkins, third team All American last year. Got beat down pretty good last year at Nebraska, 73 to 7. So in these big environments, he's hoping they can play with a little confidence. Arias back to throw, gets rid of it quickly, intercepted the second time today. There's a flag down on the play. This may go back for six points for Washington, and it does, pending the outcome of the penalty. Surprised. By the defense, number 18. 10 yards, automatic. First down. Leading receiver, signed as a free agent by the Indianapolis Colts. Big play there. Wow. Danny Shelton just blocked out the sun. Personality perspective, but also from just his body type. Gain of 10 on the play. Price quick pitch near side. It's Cason Williams again. High stepping 20. Avoids a tackler. Goes back to the middle of the field. 15 to the 10. Reverses back to the 5 and he's mowed over. Cason Williams. Taking it left side. Takes his time and then angles in and just mowed over the cornerback. Manu. Tyson Manu. Just tried to get. Expect to do it. Come and play well. And well, this is a kick that is knocked down and sent right back to the punter, then recovered by the Huskies at the 34-yard line. This is who we are. Did get some snaps against Boise State. Winds up and delivers here to the near side. The pass complete. And Campbell across the 20-yard line he is across for the first down. Down brings up a fourth down and two. And the Huskies are going to go for it. Pick up a nine. And a little Cooper is dragged around and stuffed. Goes back to receive the punt. They're going to fake it. They snapped directly to the up man, and that looked like his progress was halted just across. And here's the boot. It's up and it's wide. 
And Washington continues to pitch the shutout. 40, the nation's top running back in yardage per game, 184.5. Here's a first down throw, slanting in from Miles. Has the ball and you up tempo is communication. Here's a handoff left side, springing and getting into some air is Dwayne Washington. Look at the Jets accelerating to the sideline. Touchdown, Washington. Dwayne Washington, the red four-yard oh, scamper for the touchdown. Offense number 52, 10 yards, replay, third down. Played at this level, what, what, what are you seeing? What's happening there? Here's Miles, he unloads left side. This is Hall, jukes the tackler, getting downfield, burst to speed, 30, 20, no flags into the end zone. Touchdown, Washington. 57 yards for John Ross. He throw it out to number one. Gets a nice block from his receivers. He kind of does the rest on his own. Away he goes down the field. He's got explosiveness. He's got great hands. He's got great intangibles. I think his role is going to increase. And now if you're a defensive coordinator, you've got Jadon Mickens dominating the slot on one side. All of a sudden, Ross, he can play the slot on the other. It's mismatches against the outside linebackers all afternoon long. You're almost forcing teams to play. Fourth down and four. Arias back to throw. Fires a pass deflected and intercepted by Washington. Cleveland Wallace had it come right to him. Right place, right time. Husky ball at the 25-yard line. Dubs the Husky. Taking it all in. Beautiful sunny day. Good chance along the sideline. Fires zips a pass to the 35-yard line, and that's very close to a first down. He's got incredible arm talent. You know, and this quarterback mm -hmm. come here for a few months, an impressive young man. Keeper, Miles, here he comes, showing the Jets 50, 40-foot race. Tackler has an angle. Will he make the play at the 10? Miles dragged down inside the five-yard line. There are the Jets and the wheels and the ability to extend the play big time that Yogi was referring to from Siler Miles. Everybody on the sideline I want to see the second team get in. Cooper trying to get through does on his feet. Touchdown, Washington. Deontay Cooper. It's a day of firsts. And Cooper running that one in for the touchdown. Cooper, four yards for the TD. Wow, talk about a team coming together, playing for the loss of the teammates. Cam Richard is dragged down at the 20-yard line. Marcus make that Cleveland wallow. Um, team feels it, stadium feels it, trying to preserve a shutout. Travell Dixon defending on the far side for Washington, pressing up at Near the 11. Now he's going to bring some pressure in off the quarterback's left shoulder. But Arias is hit with a man coming straight up the middle. Right down the railroad tracks. The Washington Huskies get a big blast inside. The year has been from 50 yards long. Here's Brendan Garcia to tee it up. And that is wide. Garcia had been three for three in there. He, of course, is a redshirt freshman, and John Ross, the true freshman, a moment ago, runs in for a touchdown. Here's Miles again, slips tackles, and nearly broke that one before he's dragged down inside the 45-yard line of Idaho State. Really grooming these quarterbacks to what they've been in the past. Miles, the keeper, to the 30-yard line, and a first down for Washington. Today's cold hard facts brought to you by... Up until about midway through the third quarter, they're averaging a play every 16 seconds. McDaniel slants right side, leaning to the sideline to the 15-yard line for a first down. That's Ryan McDaniel, six-footer, 204, redshirt freshman from Torrance, California. Cool player. He's helping this program in so many ways, whether it's pushing Keith Price now, or he'll be in the competition in the spring for the starting job. Huskies over 650 total yards here this afternoon. And look at the power on display there across the 35-yard line. He has sleeves on, but seriously, I think he's done a really nice job. And you're seeing strength coaches do it all across the conference, getting guys ready to play this up-tempo type of game. And the athletes that are playing up front are different than that are playing in other conferences. Back in the shotgun. 
Behind the McDaniel block, bounces outside, straight arms and across the 20 yard line. 26 seconds left in this one and Washington leading 56 nothing.